decorating your space, you're immediately faced with what to buy and, of course, what it'll cost you. Absolutely. So Houston Life reporter Dee Brown is in the house, and she's going to prove that you don't have to empty your wallet to get the style you want. This is very true. By the way, speaking of style, my goodness, I you're thought we were doing a fashion segment. Usual. This is really well, we cool. We all are kind of blending in our own kind of way, right? Well, you know, got to give the Houston love. Mine's yeah. from Target. Yours Shout is from out. some fancy online boutique. But we all sleep seamlessly blend in together, right? Yeah, which is I mean, when you're doing your home decor, you exactly. need everything to blend. Absolutely. And when you're shopping for home decor pieces, for one, these pieces that we're going to talk about today, they are very affordable. So you always want to think about your pockets. You want to think about your budget, but you also want to think about your vision, and you never want to forget that, right? Well, uh, but also, if someone's thinking of redoing an entire room, obviously the cost of redoing a whole room, those are huge, but you're suggesting that just by popping in like a piece here and there, pieces, you can give a whole new look. Exactly. And a lot of times you get overwhelmed when you think about that process of filling up your living room, your dining. You just bought a new home, so you know you're about to be faced with that. You're going to have to redecorate the whole space. And the thing is, is that you want to get piece by piece. It'll help you to save cash, but then you don't have to worry about buying pieces and committing to it now that you may hate later. Okay, I want you to put us to a little challenge. That's what I was just about to intro us into. So the pieces <laughs> that we have out here, we're going to, you see a lot of stuff out here, but there are five in particular we're going to talk about today on the show. Okay. So we're going to give you guys 30 seconds if we could get that on the monitor here. Should we we'll, say which pieces we're, we're talking about? Yeah, okay, so we're going to do the chair. Okay. We're going to do this table here these lovely faux artichokes and we're going to do this um, little inside deal for your bed and then this picture here in the corner. And all this stuff you got like home goods, overstock, where exactly. did you find this stuff? Home goods, overstock, most of it is from overstock but I did go and get some pieces from home goods as well so it's kind of a mixture of things. Okay, okay. and some little accessories. So what's, from what's our challenge? What you're going to do, you have your cards in your hand, Derek has the one with like the little Dion orange, Jennifer doesn't have anything on her cards, you guys are going to get 30 seconds to label the prices for each of these items. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to step back and I'm going to let you guys want to go. You okay. Ready? And we have everything ranging from $48 up All to 144. 144. Right. And again, it's the artwork, yes. this side table, yes. artichokes, the artichokes, another table, side table, chair. and the chair. Okay, you ready? You ready? Three, uh, <laughs> two, okay. one, go. If those are more than 48 bucks, I don't know what I'll do. Uh, I think I'm gonna. I'm joining you on the 48 bucks right there. 130. So I think. 30 and 130. Okay, I'm going. Oh, decisions, decisions. Or is it? We do the chair. I'm gonna, just to be different, I'm gonna do that one, and I'm gonna go there. Just okay, to be different. You guys have 10 seconds. Okay. Come on, you guys are moving like. You got molasses. Well, because you know he's still done. 10 seconds he's on the clock. Got molasses. Are you done? We're okay, both done. So with five seconds left, you guys are done. Okay. Okay. So we're going to go through each item starting here with the chair. So let me check to see who's right. We both who's did 144.46. Um, no, you're both the wrong. We're both Ooh. wrong? You're both wrong. How much was the chair? The chair is 130. 130 bucks. Wow. Okay. Yes, this chair is 130 bucks at Home Goods. It's super cute, super chic. I really think it's more of your style for sure, but you can just throw it in your living room, throw in a toss pillow. Kind of gives you that mid-century mod type of feel. Yeah. Um, but the trend that we're looking at here is the texture. So we get the texture not only in the chair, but also the accent pillow that I paired with it. Don't be afraid to add a little bit of pop of color if you're using textures like leather and things like that. Well, so. and a lot of people, I mean, we were talking about this because you were over at my place last week. Yeah. I have that charcoal gray couch oh, and a leather chair yeah. similar. Yeah. And it, for some people who don't like leather, it's a little too overwhelming to it, do yeah, too much. It, I'm not a, are you a leather fan? I'm not a leather fan. I, you know, not on like huge pieces. This I could this easily chair, do. I would though. totally. I'm do. an antique fan, but not a huge leather. When fan. I think of leather, I think of the 1990s. I think of my aunt's house. Just really weird <laughs> stuff. I mean, hey, no, we but, don't want to offend anyone. Are you thinking about pleather? Remember back in the well, day, yeah, of pleather, and it yeah. was split, and you have to get like duct tape. Have you ever seen it? No, okay, don't worry. Leather about is also great. One text. of the trends I've seen in leather these days too is those little square ottomans that you can find. Exactly, and those are perfect, not just for putting your feet on top of, but you can do a blanket on top of it, a throw. You could even stack magazines and books just to kind of add like a little pop of peace yeah. in your house. So. Okay, so I love this table. I love the earthiness of it. Yes. Well, I know you guys got this one right. Um, let me just walk. Oh, wow. Look at that. You guys got that answer right. Yes, it is 130. The side table also came from Home Goods. Um, it's, I feel like it's a multifunctional type of piece. I feel like this is something that you can accent the side of your chair, the side of your sofa, but on the side of your bed. Would you or would you not do that? I would totally use it as a nightstand. It is such a great table. In fact, yeah, I mean, I guess we're seeing the shape pretty well from that close-up shot there. This is great. This would be um, cool in a, in a living room, too. No, it would be cool in a living room, but again, this is 
such a statement piece. Do not put pieces on top that compete with the actual statement of the um, table. What do you so, mean? So for an example, these little simple little faux plants that I use there, that's enough. You probably don't even need anything, but I added those in to add a little contrast to go against the wood or whatever. But keeping but that earthy feel to earthy it, feel kind of blending in just like a natural landscape. Inside, which is the second trend. I love it. It's beautiful. Yes. Okay, these artichokes, please tell me we, we got this price right. We both guessed just under 50 bucks, 48 bucks. You guys are actually wrong. Kidding. No. Uh, <laughs> the right. I love the reaction. No, you are correct. These, <laughs> finally, they are from Overstock. And the trend that we're doing here is actually using kind of like the faux pieces. So it's okay if you want to use lemons. And in this case, we're using artichokes and things like that, the faux greenery. So that's the trend that we're using here. But get this. These were originally priced at, um, I believe it was, well, I say overall, we're saving 17 bucks and 55 cents, but the overall price is 48 49 Wait, I mean, I'm not that familiar with faux artichokes. Yeah. I haven't shopped for them lately. I don't know. <clears> I like the, shop. I like I the texture your shopping in it, the, the colors in it. It's what is it that you hate about them? Well, no, I just don't know. I mean, is that expensive for a faux artichoke, like around eight or nine bucks a piece? So I had this conversation with Erin, and when I showed her the piece, she was like, Aaron, our producer. Aaron, one of our producers. Like, yeah. She was like, uh, I think that's just too much. And I was like, mm, well, it just depends on what works for you. Aaron is saying in my ear, yep, it's See, no, too I much. Think I, I'm sitting here in my head going, okay, they look great in a basket, but then you can also do them, like if you wanted to do them on one a by center one. piece, do them in a centerpiece in glass canisters. And not only oh, yeah. that, they will be great if you're having friends over for dinner, if you want to use them as their name, to hold their name cards. <gasps> great idea. Yep. So put great it in each idea. of the plates. Wouldn't that be cute? You are See, so apparently fancy. Apparently, we're the multitaskers. And name the cards in an user. artichoke? <laughs> yeah. I'm come to dinner at your oh, house. I was about to say, <laughs> So let's move on to the nightstand. <laughs> okay, the nightstand. So one, oh wow, there's a 49% difference here. <laughs> <laughs> Um, Derek is, no, Jennifer's correct. It's 130.49. <laughs> so she beat you by 49 cents. This is 130.49 <laughs> at Overstock. Um, this is a nightstand. So again, you have something simple, something that's multifunctional. You can also use it in your living room as well. It comes with the two drawers in the front. You can stick books there. Oh, look, there's Michelle Obama. And you can, uh, <laughs> you can also. <laughs> Michelle Obama is not in the drawer. It's a Michelle it's Obama a book, book in book. the drawer. Um, Don't be alarmed. You can use it as a charging station for your cell phone, your iPads, things like that. So it's super cute. Keep it simple. As you can see, I just added a stack of Vogue magazines, which are my fave. And hey, do you want a lamp or something easy? Yeah. It's gray. I mean, this gray wood, is this a trend that's oh, going to stick around, though? Because absolutely. people may, like, if you have white or acorn, chestnut, walnut, whatever kind of wood furniture, yes. can you really mix gray with it? So you're getting two trends. You're getting the gray wood, but you're also getting um, a piece that can be used in multiple ways. As I mentioned before, you can not only use it in the bedroom, you can use it in your living room. I even think if your bathroom is large enough and you have the space to kind of tuck it away in the corner, you could use it, roll it up, put towels in the drawers, and there you have it. Wow. So it's something I feel like you can just move all over the house and you yeah. can get a bang for your buck. For and sure. one of the best parts is it's delivered to your or front door. I mean, you don't like, have to haul it home. Even like in a little mud room or your entryway or something. I agree. Got some space in Lots there. Lots of cuteness, yeah. right? Yeah. All right, last but not least, this uh, framed artwork here. Is yes. this Ansel, Ansel Adams? Adams? Yes, uh, this piece of frame artwork. That's the one pretty. thing that I love about this really is pretty. that, um, well, for one, you guys are both wrong uh, for the price. Wait, uh, I said how are we both wrong? No, because the painting or oh, the picture is actually 144.46. Oh, that's right. We messed up on oh, the we first messed up on the chair. So isn't it interesting that this piece is the most expensive piece that's out here? And you would think it would be the chair, right? But it's well, actually this piece of... You know, this is a great classic piece. I've seen this uh, this photo before. It's probably because it's Ansel Adams right. that it's a little exactly. on the price. I almost side. went exactly. with the 144 for that very reason, yep. thinking it's, it looks like Ansel Adams. You know what else? Another site I love is art.com. You oh, can yeah, get, you like, can I have Picassos that are 10 bucks. But did you know that you can also go to Etsy and you can actually purchase images and download them and then actually get them and blown? Yeah, and you can frame them yourself. Genius. So that's a great way you She's shave. She's got so many great the ideas. shipping costs and everything. But... This has actually been marked down by 205 bucks. Wow. So, yeah, so it's 144.46. And I mean, that's a bang for your buck. And the thing that I would do with this one, I would actually create an art wall. I have a couple of quick examples. I know that we're having to wrap up, but there's a young lady. Oh my gosh, she's an interior decorator. I've shared her work <gasps> with you before. And she can deck out a wall like I've never seen before. So nub interiors uh, on, uh, on Instagram. Nub newbie interiors, uh-huh. And she's actually based in Tennessee. And oh, she, yeah. her home is just absolutely Amazing. Oh, look at that Broy Hill credenza that. right there. Yeah, she's like great. a gallery wall so you can kind of keep changing out the pictures too. You know, and that's the thing that I, when we had a gallery wall, I would do it all the time. You know, you can use pictures of your family. You can use pictures of nature. You can actually get a picture like this from Overstock. And even underneath the picture from Overstock, there's a piece that I grabbed off of my wall because I would totally use that for wall 
short, so there you have it. I want to come hang out with you for a weekend. Come hang out. Yeah. Guys, yeah. if you'd like to recreate some of the looks Dee showed us today on the show, Overstock is having a summer clearance sale where you can get, as she mentioned, up to 70% off right now. Just visit their website, overstock.com, if you want to check them out. Dee Brown, thanks so much. Thank you, guys. All right, guys, to get the perfect body with